everybody. My name is Barbara Denampont, and I am the host of Gangaji's podcast, Being Yourself. This month, we have a special podcast extra to share with you. It's just a short piece, an inquiry that I think you might really enjoy called What Blocks Your Fulfillment? Just take a moment and discover what do you think blocks your fulfillment? Because if your fulfillment is blocked, you think you know what it is that's blocking it. And that can be millions of different things. It can be what you deserve, or what somebody did to you, or a mistake you made, or what, how you got overlooked, whatever it is, that you're bad, that you haven't done it right, that there's more work to do, whatever it is, just be willing in this moment to inquire, what blocks my fulfillment? And then you see, maybe it's a whole constellation of things, but it is rooted in some primary thought. And that thought has been reinforced throughout your upbringing, both secular and spiritual, and it never gets challenged. It just becomes the impetus to do more, to do better, or to fix it, or to thumb your nose at it, or whatever. So the possibility is to return, not to the thought, but to recognize and return to what fuels that thought. Because that thought can exist as a power to, to make you miserable without some emotion fueling it. And people have come up here and shared, in particular, what the emotions were, worthlessness or undeservability, or not me. So what is it for you? This is like very simple, broad stroke of what's blocking my fulfillment and what fuels that. And if you're willing, I guarantee you have the capacity, but if you're willing, you can actually open to what you have been running away from and avoiding, and in the course of that, overlooking your own fulfillment, your own awakening, your own wholeness. Fulfillment is the same as enlightenment. Just another word. Peace. No need to go anywhere or do anything. <laughs>